Hello there and welcome. This is Oliver from A Money Plan. Yes, today we're just going to talk about dreams and goals. I'm just going to make this really brief. Um, just to kind of invoke thought and what, where you're currently at and what you're currently doing and what you want to do. Uh, dreams and goals. Okay. Let's do for an example, if you are working a nine to five, if you have a steady job, but one of your goals is you want to quit your job and become your own boss. Actually, depending on where you at and how much you owe, it's not a very far trip. If, if you in way over your head and debt and think, uh, debt is, it could be a little journey or a little longer, depending on your, your responsibilities. If you got kids, teenagers, a house, you know, cars and different things that you are in debt to. So you're basically at that point is locked in the grid. And what I mean by that is that grid, that matrix is to hit that 95 every day. Um, but most people, the most, the majority of the people don't even like their jobs. Okay. And, um, but if that's a goal, to become your own boss and you know quit your job one thing to look at is your dreams and goals that you have to start somewhere for an example if you're working a nine to five you have other responsibility you might want to take 30 minutes 45 minutes to an hour each day at least five days a week into something that you want to start doing and working on um, and apply that each and every day till until it increasingly maybe you start seeing money from it and scaling up you know as you go along and maybe one day you can hit that goal real soon but your dreams and your goals never let them die if they die it's because you lost that dream you lost your aspirations and goals and achievements that you wanted to hit so food for thought always look outside the box most of us are in this world stuck in this matrix and we're just stuck but there is a way out don't forget to subscribe i'm oliver and i'm out